You know, when you leave your country, that's a very tough decision that you take. When you have a country that is falling apart, this is not because you choose to have a better job and then start walking, you know, from Macedonia to Germany. This is because if you don't leave your house and your city, you're going to be dead. And therefore, you go in search of hope. All this hope turned into energy, into transformation, into a desire to do better. And the leaders should explain to their public that they're taking the calculated risk that it is a down payment to get the benefits later. And remember what happened in Spain. The migrants, five million of them over a 10-year period, practically you saved the financial solvency. The young have to go out and integrate. And this is why the language becomes absolutely crucial. They can communicate, integrate, and because then the skills issue, the skills stage, the adoption of skills becomes that much easier. It's about immersion. With the proper skills, they're going to be paying taxes, they're going to be productive, and therefore help you in your productivity, help you in your continued growth, help you to compensate the aging process. Europe pronounce itself open with the caveats. It should continue to be the case. Because when all of this is off the front pages, it's still going to be integration, integration, integration. They're already there. We have to do a better job than dismantling Schengen or putting barbed wire to stop them from coming. <laughs>